Okay, so we want to start off with really greasy hair and you just want to deep how ugly you are. But then you're going to put your hair up into a ponytail. It can only get better from here, boys. We're going to look like an egg for about 20 minutes, but it's fine. And then you also realize that you're a mess and nothing's going to save you. So you want to start off with some moisturizer. This one's my favorite. You can find this in every Asian household, if not some Nivea cream. And because I've got eczema, I just really lather that onto my face. So if you get frown lines, make sure to put some extra moisturizer there to avoid creasing during the day. Now you just want to go in with some primer. I always use the NYX Studio Primer and at least kind of like a white cast. So really try and rub the skin. Again, I focus this near the bottom of my face where I get creasing. And you just really want to rub that into your skin or you're going to look like you're from Area 51 with blue skin. Now onto my eyebrows. Always use the Collection 2000 Brunette Eyebrow Kit and I just like to make a fake little arch that's how I like my eyebrows moving on to concealer this is the revolution conceal and define and mine is super light for me because I'm using my mum's at the moment so you're gonna try and blend this in as best as you can so I just arch out my eyebrows and put some on my lid too but don't worry about the whiteness we're gonna fix it with foundation I'm just realizing how white it looks <laughs> so we're using the Fenty Beauty foundation obviously and this oxidizes so I like to put this on now before um, I do like my eyeshadow and stuff just so it can set and you can see how matte it gets and how it darkens in colour so that's just going to fix my forehead and I like to put a little on my eyelids as well just to make everything the same kind of base colour I'm just setting my eyebrows it's so dirty that I don't want to show you but it's basically the, wow I'm disgusting it's basically the benefit brow gel and I'm just fixing my eyebrows in place now I'm taking the Huda Beauty rose gold palette and sandalwood and we're just gonna start building that into our crease and just blend as much as you can And now we're taking the colour Henna and you just want to start to deepen and darken your crease as much as you can. I like doing this gradually because you can kind of just build the colour and try and go with a light hand. And if you mess up like me and get it everywhere, don't worry because we haven't done concealer yet. And now I'm just taking Coco on the outer V and just pushing that in to add some more definition. Now we're taking moon dust. Is it moon dust? I don't know. I'm not a beauty guru, but we're going to spray that and then pack that onto our lids. It's just a really beautiful gold colour. Taking demure, and I'm just going to use that as like a transition shade to blend everything together while I'm talking like a makeup artist and really not. Um, then this BYS eyeliner, which cost me like a dollar in Australia and my GWA Sinner eyelashes. I obviously just got them for the name. Um, while it dries the glue, I just like to curl my lashes and then here's me applying them. And we're going to blend that all in with the Better Than Sex mascara. So now moving on to highlight, again I'm using the Revolution concealer which is too light but now the foundation is kind of set and it's all going to blend in together, don't worry guys. Um, and yeah, my new nose piercing which is so hard to do makeup with, trust me. And then just going back in with that eyeliner and making sure that you can't see the glue. And now I'm just setting my face with powder, which I don't know <laughs> what powder it is. So there we go. Now taking the sleek contour kit, I love this. This is the main step to just not looking like yourself, giving myself some jawline. <laughs> removing my double chin and then shrinking my nose and you want to take the contour all the way up by your eyelid this really kind of slims it down 
Now I'm taking my Too Faced blusher. This one's in Peach Beach. I always use this. I'm living my life. I love blusher. We really love the blusher. And you just want to pack that on. The more the merrier. Now just any setting spray will do. Set your face. Um, I'm using my favourite highlighter from Too Faced. And again, I just love highlighter, so I put way more than necessary on. And then I'm just putting a bit with my finger onto my lid to give my lids a bit more of a shimmer. Now I'm using the Huda Beauty Lip Mix In Cheerleader, and you just want to overline your lips because we can't afford lip fillers out here, and I'm just scared of needles, so we're just going to overline. I would have put liner on, but I was going to brush. I was going to Costco, you know, doing a full beat for Costco, who do I think I am, with eyelashes, oh my god. But just overline your lips as much as you can, try and make sure it doesn't look too fake. <laughs> and now we're going to sort out this brush on my head, love that. Exposed. Um, just brush everything out and then I always just, if my hair's a bit squeezy, I'm just going to curl the ends and that's it, just leave it as it is. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you did please smash a like and subscribe, we're nearly at a thousand subs and I will see you guys in my next video.